Australia's Prime Minister's 11 had a solid start with Matthew Renshaw scoring 81 and Marcus Harris gaining 73. Alzari Joseph was brutal with the ball, grabbing four wickets for 64 runs in 19.5 overs, with this one being the best of them all. In response, Tej Narang Chandapal, like father, like son, played a marathon 293 ball innings, scoring 119 runs. He stroked 13 fours and 1-6 in his knock that became the substance of the innings. His skipper, Craig Brathwaite, was the only other batter of note with 47 runs. The Caribbean men went to bed on 234 for 7 at stumps on day 2, still trailed by 88 runs. At the close of play, Chandapal said it was rugged at the start. A bit tough, get through the new ball up front and um, try and get a score, keep things going and try and score when I can. Nice to get some runs today and um, yeah, feel and hopefully things go well. The Guyanese batter spoke on him replicating his father Shiv Narayan. Yeah, just try and be myself, you know, I can uh, replicate him, so I just try, uh, try and be myself. This century gave him high hopes of a test debut. Well, fingers crossed. Try and stay tight and try and get some runs here as well. The match continues on Friday with day three at the Manuka Oval in Canberra.